Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna to be trying to explain and show you how you can use the scoreboard objectives to add statistics to the side of your screen. So this might be useful if you wanna uh, track live statistics as um, you're playing the game. So if we just go over here, as you can see, the blocks mined scoreboard is at three, three, seven, seven, three, seven, seven, three million, basically. And if I go and mine this block, it'll go up to uh, plus one. Minus one, plus one. So yeah, that's the live statistic that I've set. I have in my world, if we go to statistics, mind this one, it's kind of hard to see because Minecraft formatting is a little weird, but the numbers should be the same. So let's set up a new one just so I can show you an example of how to do it. So I already have the commands pre-written down. I'll just explain them. They're a little hard to uh, understand if you're not too familiar with how they work. But what you want to do is have cheats on or have a LAN enabled world with cheats enabled. This allows you to use commands because I'm pretty sure these are considered cheats. I'm not sure how, but they are. So if we go to the very top of my clipboard here, we'll see slash scoreboard objectives add. And this is where you would make your uh, name. So let's say I want to use sword swing. Uh, you can name it whatever you want. I'm gonna call it Sword Swing. Make sure they're all um, one word for the name. And then uh, the criteria for your thing. So I wanna do slash, uh, I believe it's use. It's kinda of hard to think here. Uh, picked up, no. Minecraft. Used, used, used. Minecraft used there we go and this category allows you to um, basically log how many items you use I believe this counts as placing them or right clicking on a certain function so minecraft slash used minecraft dot and then we'll use uh, diamond pickaxe diamond underscore pickaxe there we go as you can see and then we do slash uh, we do enter and then that'll create the objective sword swing or whatever you called it. Next, you wanna go ahead and um, uh, set that to whatever you want. So let's set the uh, sword swing objective that we just made to zero. So it'd be slash scoreboard players set your name or at P or whoever you want to set it towards uh, the name of the objective and then whatever score you want it to be at. So that'll be the big number or small number uh, right next to your name on the scoreboard objective as you see on the right side. So let's set that as zero. Next, you wanna have the scoreboard being shown. So uh, you wanna go ahead and set the display. So it's slash scoreboard objective slash set and then for wherever you wanna have it, you can put it in a bunch of different uh, categories. Now let's just go all the way to the end here just so you can see all of them. We have below name, list, sidebar. This is my personal uh, favorite because I can see it at all times, no matter what I'm doing, or whatever else we got here. I believe if you have uh, multiple, you can have um, several at the same time. I'm not entirely sure, but uh, yeah, we'll just use sidebar for now. And then space, and then the name of the objective that you just made or you want to show. So we have sword swing, and then we press enter. And as you can see, we now have a sword swing objective on the right side. And if we grab a netherite sword, I believe, or a diamond sword, I believe, that I uh, had set up here. And then we go ahead and go over here to the funny place. And we oh, hit the cow. That didn't work. It's because clearly, if I. I use a diamond pickaxe, because that makes sense, because I'm actually very, very illiterate. And I meant to use a... I ignore that, ignore that for now. We'll pretend like that didn't happen. So yeah, if we just go over here and mine sand with a pickaxe as any normal person would, you'll see the number goes up, because you're using your sword swing, obviously. I ignore that little typo, but that is what it is called, not necessarily the defined function of it. But yeah, you can. I would have. Uh, I would have called it pickaxe swing, or you know, whatever block I wanted to use. Uh, mind. Uh, so yeah, anytime you use the tool you have set, uh, as shown in right here. Let's say we want to have this one called uh, add. I don't know. Uh, 
uh, beds. Oh, okay, it's called white. White underscore bed. There we go, and then we just want to set that display to zero. So, beds zero, Minecraft. Set display, objectives, add set display, beds. There we go, so now we use the bed, we place the bed, the bed goes up. Sleep in the bed, break the bed, place the bed, repeat process until you have as many beds placed as you want. It's a pretty great system, I do say so myself. So yeah, that's how you do it. If you enjoyed, make sure to like the video, subscribe. If you like me being extremely illiterate and not knowing what I type. Uh, and with that, I'll see you next time. Have a good day. Bye.